Hi, in my previous videos, I have made CNC 3018, CNC drawing machine, and CNC laser engraver. So basically, all of these machines are running on Gerber firmware, or you can say GRBL firmware, and Arduino Uno as a microcontroller. So most of the viewers are asking me how to upload the Gerber firmware to Arduino Uno. So today, in this video, I will teach you how you can upload the Gerber firmware to Arduino Uno. So let's start the video. First of all, you need to download the Arduino IDE environment. For that purpose, just type Arduino IDE download on Google search and you will find the link. Click here Arduino IDE. And then you can download the software from here depending on your windows mac or linux any operating system you are using another way you can download the arduino id is from the microsoft app store just go to the microsoft app store and simply search here arduino id or simply ide You will see here the app Arduino IDE. I have already installed it. So this is showing installed. So once you have installed the Arduino IDE environment, the second step is you have to download the Gerber firmware. You can download it from the GitHub or simply on the Google type GRBL. 1.1 h firmware download as this is an open source firmware so simply click here and you can download it from here download zip Once you have downloaded the Gerber firmware, just open it. Gerber master. I will copy this and paste on desktop. Or you can paste it anywhere you want. I will paste it here. Now what you have to do just open the Arduino IDE here you can see so once you have opened it you have to include the GRBL library in your IDE for that what you have to do just go to this cache include library add a zip library go to the desktop the GRBL master then GRBL we are not importing the zip file we are importing the GRBL file just remember this open as I have already included the library so this shows that a library named GRBL already exists so once you have imported the library you have to go to the files then go to the examples Down here you will find your GRBL library. Simply click on GRBL upload. As you can see. When coming to the tools, we can see our board is not connected. So from here you have to connect your Arduino board. Once the board is connected, you will see it will show the COM port. COM7 and Arduino Uno. Just click here. And now if you want to compile the sketch first that is good or you can directly upload it to the board i will show the compile process there is a tick click here so this will start compiling your sketch so compiling is done now there is an arrow which shows the upload option just click here so your code is being uploaded
so done uploading now you can check either your board has got the firmware correctly or not for that purpose you have to download the open build software this is an open source uh, user interface to control your CNC machines running on Arduino Uno simply open that so you can see Arduino Uno COM7 so I will connect so now you can see so firmware is detected GRBL 1.1 H so now you will see this is working correctly so another question was how you can calibrate your machine so basically the GRBL firmware is very easy to calibrate with this open build software what you have to do just connect your board and come to the GRBL settings when you are here in the setting you have different parameters so basically here is the X reversed this is the step direction like if you are pressing the right key and your machine is moving towards the left so simply invert this direction okay you can do it for all the X's for X Y and Z now coming to the steps calibration it is very easy in open build here you can see x steps per millimeter so you can calculate manually that is a very complex process open build make it very easy just click here calculate depths now as we know our machine is lead screw driven okay so here you can see lead screw type 8 mm pitch 2 mm or 4 mm of start so we have to select the lead screw driven after that we can select the pitch as my machine is running on a 8 mm lead screw with 2 mm of pitch so I will select this after that you have to know these uh, steps per rotation for your motors I am using the NEMA 17 stepper motor which has 1.8 degree of step then micro stepping then the micro step setting I am using 1 by 16th of a step just click here so it has automatically calculated 400 steps for my machine so I will simply select apply calculated values to the GRBL setting after that I am using the same lead screw for same lead screw and same motor for all of my axes so I will simply type here 400 and here 400 as well the next step is maximum feed rate it depends on your machine structure so how fast you want to run your machine my machine is a basic hobby machine so i can type 1500 for x 1500 millimeter per minute for the y and 1000 millimeter per meter for the z axis for the acceleration i will type 100 for the x 100 for the y and 100 for the Z as well and the maximum travel for the X axis is as we know our machine is 30 18 30 centimeters or 300 millimeters for the X axis and 180 millimeters for the Y axis and Z axis we have a 42 mm of travel now here you can see save to the firmware just click here so it will automatically save all of your settings and now you have to restart yes so this was the uh, code upload process and the calibration process for our CNC 3018 homemade machine I hope after watching this video you will be able to upload the Google firmware and calibrate your machines if you have any questions let me know in the comment section and please subscribe to the channel Thank you.